Thank you, Caroline. Tonight, the Target 12 investigators go one-on-one -on -one with one of the alleged victims from the Gordon School child molestation investigation. The teacher, now 69 years old, denies the accusations, but several of his former students claim they were molested. Target 12 investigator Walt Buteau joins us now live in studio. Walt. These accusations bring us back to the mid-70s. We talked through FaceTime with one of Andrew Cohen's students who alleges he stole her innocence. It was the 1974 academic year at the Gordon School. Lisa Cantor was 12 years old when the school year started. According to the East Providence Police Incident Report, Cantor told investigators in 2017 Cohen was attempting to be a counselor to her regarding family issues back then. But she alleges he sexually abused her multiple times after that, both in the school and in other locations. The police report indicates alleged victims went to police and school administrators with similar accusations against Cohen. That was a major lapse on the part of Gordon School and the East Providence Police Department at the time. People were seeing it and turning the other way because they didn't quite know what to do with it or they just chose not to. Cantor told police in 2017 she called Cohen when she was in college saying, you sexually abused me. She told investigators Cohen said, quote, you seem to like it at the time. Cohen continued, according to Cantor, saying it's our culture making you think this is wrong. It's perfectly acceptable in other cultures. We called Cohen without a response and then went to his door where an unidentified woman answered. Can we just talk to him about the allegations? Nope. According to a letter sent to parents from the school, Cohen has denied the allegations by Cantor and the other alleged victims. There were allegations that were equally credible then as they are now, but at the time um, they did not do what was right. Cantor tells us both the school and police are doing a great job in her opinion with the current investigation, which we're told is ongoing by police and under review by the Attorney General's office. With the Target 12 investigators, Walt Buteau, Eyewitness News.